Yo yo people, welcome back to Run Tech Hub. And today I'm going to be showing you guys how to update the Zim Matrix firmware. Now, this is the website that you're going to be using to download the firmware. This is the official Zim community, the official Zim website. You can find the instructions over on Obsessive's YouTube channel as well, but I'm just going to walk everyone through step by step what to do. When you go to this page currently, this is, um, what is it? The 1st of June, 2023. This is all you will see for later on for after there has been loads more updates for firmware and manager you might see some more stuff here so all you need to do is to go to the one that says zim matrix firmware the manager that's going to be the application that you use to actually put settings onto your zim matrix i'm going to click on this one here that says zim matrix firmware it's going to take me to another section of the web page and down here i can either download for pc or I can download for Mac OS. I don't have a Mac laptop, so I'm just going to go PC. And the instructions are also here. But let's click on this to download it. I've already downloaded it. That's why you see a second thing there. But let me just clear that off screen. I'm going to click on this. It's going to start downloading. For people who have um, Google Chrome, it's going to show up at the bottom left hand corner of your screen. For people who have, who have Microsoft Edge, I believe, and Firefox, it might show up at the top right hand corner. So now that the file has been downloaded, I'm going to plug my Zim matrix into my PC. All I'm going to do is to connect my Zim matrix to my laptop. And all I have to do is press that button on the Zim matrix and plug the USB cable into my laptop. Lucky for us, the Zim matrix only has one single button. So there's no, there's no real mistake that we can make here. So press and hold the button down, plug the USB cable into the laptop. You're going to hear that USB connection sound that Windows has. As soon as you hear that sound, let go off the button. The light on the B-loader should be a solid light, as in it's not flashing, it's not blinking or anything, and it should be the color blue. Once you have that, I would go to my downloads folder. Now that's different for different operating systems like Windows and Mac, but the way I tend to do it, I simply press and hold Windows flag on my keyboard and press E for echo. All of this stuff here comes up and I simply go to downloads. Once I go to download, it's going to be the very first thing at the top for me because it's the very last thing I downloaded. I'm going to double click on this. You can update firmware, you can factory reset, you can backup or you can restore. Before you do anything at all, I always, always, always suggest that you back everything that you have up. Because even if you are doing this later on in the future and you're updating to a different version of the Zim Matrix software, backing up your stuff means that if something goes wrong, it's going to be there. You can always go back and get it. So click backup, click the location you want to save it in. I'm just going to choose desktop for now. And I think I already have a backup. So I'm just going to put this as V2 for version two on my desktop. You choose where you want to save it. And I'm going to click save. That's backing up my file there and done. Perfect. Now it closes everything straight away, but and I'm going to want to plug it back in. So I'm going to hold that button down again, plug the USB cable back in. Again, once I hear that sound, I know I'm good to go. Blue light is there. It's not flashing. Everything is okay for me. I'm going to double click on this and I'm going to do update firmware. Because I already have the latest version of the firmware, this doesn't work for me. But if you do not have the latest version of the firmware, this should work perfectly fine. Give it about a minute or so. Mine took like 20 seconds to be fair. And then once it's done, it's going to disconnect itself. It's going to close everything down and you should be good to go. And that's it. So good luck. Have fun.